here. This is the federal classified documents case getting delayed indefinitely, is it? Talk to us about that. It was scheduled for May 20th, right? Right. We're just getting our own eyes on this order here. But Judge Cannon making it clear that the trial over classified documents is delayed indefinitely in Florida. This federal indictment leads to the question of whether this trial would begin before the November election. And I think they would be safe to say that this order here from Judge Cannon in Florida answers that question. And so we could very well be looking at a reality that the only criminal trial only one of four that Donald Trump is facing here is, that will take place before the November election will be this one here that is now in its fourth week in New York over the alleged hush money payment scheme uh, that Donald Trump is currently coming into lower Manhattan every day for uh, that is ongoing, Aaron. All right, Vaughn, I'm going to ask you to stand by here for just a second. Turn to Danny Savalos, our NBC News legal analyst. Danny, I just want to get your take on what we just learned about uh, happening in Florida, the, the delay, the indefinite delay of proceedings there. It's a very interesting development. I mean, normally in federal court, that's the place where cases fly. They move very quickly. But, of course, the Trump cases in federal court are obviously different because they involve so many complicated legal issues that delay was almost a certainty. So it is very, uh, very interesting that the court is going to delay this indefinitely. Uh, at some point, they need to schedule a trial. Normally in federal court, they'll schedule a trial date and then change it later. But indefinitely is an interesting development. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.